as Kepka sets up for his eagle putt at seven, Sam. Thank you, Alison. Uh, it's, oh, well, that's a nice time for me to start. Can't keep doing this though, can he? We said that yesterday and you wouldn't think so. Vital. No. Oh, that was pretty casual. Fluffy sand. Have to get it up quick over the face and that is just all world right there. That's why he's the number one ranked player in the world. Two gone in three holes, I'm afraid, for the 2017 Open champion. Yeah, the pin position's on the left side of this green today. You're just going up just left of that bunker. Greenside bunker. Oh, oh. He's going straight out of it. Come on! Oh, I don't think that is. For an eagle to get to eight under. Okay. Ron finally holds a putt, and you almost feel for him. You get, you're feeling his frustration. You get frustrated watching him. Does land for Jordan Spieth. Well, what a move this is. Stunning. Not at all what Louis Ustazen was looking for. Good as he could do. Had nothing there. Another glorious iron shot from John Rahm. For a little left to right, can he finally hole one? Oh, again, the frustration mounts. Quite a narrow slither of green at pin high. How about this? How about this? Come back to the right. It's trying to. It's trying to. Whoa! Sneaks in the back door. Oh. That's fine. Play that nice pitch shot in. This is his range right here. This to get into double digits under par. How Told can you, you doubt him? Told you. He makes them all from that range. <laughs> To back birdies for Colin Morikawa, seven and eight, and he extends his lead to three. And this is hidden hope. Ah. Considering how far left it was. Oh, oh! Could this be the Oosthuizen resurgence right here? Pitched in the perfect spot. It's just not happening, I'm afraid, for the South African, the 2010 Open champion. Oh, he 
pours it in. It's a third straight birdie for Colin Morikawa. He needs to start pouring these in. Are you surprised? No. It's not a tremendous amount of undulations he has to deal with, but he has to pitch up to get to the green. Could it? What a brilliant shot right there. Looking down the right, just trying to chase it up, maybe just a fraction. Needs to grab this round and get going. And that's a good start. Oh! My word! Hits the flagstick. Gap wedge. Trying to draw it in. Oh, it spins in. Very good shot. He makes his birdie, two in a row for the Spaniard. Oh, he's trying a low skipper and spinner. Grab and get up that slope. Oh, is it going to stay? Yes, it is. Listen to the roar. Third birdie of the back nine for Jordan Spieth. And this is for three birdies in a row. Dangerous holes coming up for those behind him. Ron's going to keep him honest right there. Big birdie from Ron. Joins Luke Hazen on 10 under par and a tie for third. This whole location should suit his shot shape. Right side of the green. Aim it up the middle. Let it work to the right. How aggressive do you want to be with that slope just to the right? That aggressive. He is taking dead aim. That is an incredible shot and a brave shot. Brilliant, brilliant. Well, just when he needed it, Morikawa pounces again. That's an excellent shot. Fantastic, just fantastic. Well, McKenzie Hughes, this is for birdie on 18, as we break good bid right to left. There you go, there you go. Excellent week, excellent putt. And as Jay said, moving to world number one. I guess a decent prize as well. He's here for the long haul. No mistakes this time. A closing 66 for Jordan Spieth. And it is good to have him back and contending at major championships, no doubt about that. Another great effort, but not what he wanted. Was looking for a second clear at Jug. It's not going to go to him. And he can look forward to going back to St Andrews, where he won in 2010 and came close in 2015. Remember no fans when he won the PGA, so what a treat for him. Finally show off in front of spectators.
with the power at the last. It is a nerveless, it is a faultless performance from 24-year-old Colin Morikawa. Who wins on his open debut. And with a score of 265, the winner of the gold medal and the champion golfer of the year is Colin Morikawa. to be out on this beautiful golf course. Royal St. George has put on a great, great major championship. And um, to be called the Open Championship winner, to be called the championship winner of the year, um, it gives me chills. It's giving me chills right now. So thank you guys to everyone, every single one of you out here, every single one of you guys watching. Um, let's keep this going. Thank you guys.